hi guys so anthropic just released <laughs> we've been waiting for this cloud 4 sonnet and surprisingly um cloud 4 opus we're going to test out their coding the benchmarks don't look very impressive from 3.7 3.7 is even winning on some i don't see the ada polyglot benchmark here but we're going to test some coding now let's just get into it Okay, Anthropic, Cloud4, Sonnet, that's good. Create a simulation, dimensions from 1D to 5D. Okay. Let's to create a VIT application, that's a good start. React JavaScript dimensional okay. Do what you have to do. They said it's good in it's better in tool calling than 3.7 Sonnet. We'll see. To install 3JS there. Okay, it's writing some code already. He knows that uh, fourth dimension is a tesseract. One dimension. Oh, this looks good. One D point on a line. This, this, this looks good, man. Okay. A point moving along a line only has length that's it i can zoom in with my mouse and i can move it around with my mouse okay let's go to the second dimension a shape in a plane with length and width x and y axis a two by two square rotating in a plane Let's look at it. Okay. Still makes sense. Even the text is in 3D. Okay, that's good. Let's go to the third dimension. An object in space with length, width, and height. A 2x2x2 two by two by two cube rotating in a 3D space. Let's look at it. Okay, this makes sense. Is X, Y, and Z or Z axis. Let me zoom in a bit. Fourth dimension is a tesseract with an additional W axis. We can only see its 3D projection. Okay, let's try to put the text this side. For D tesseract, there's a cube in a cube. Okay, fifth dimension, hypercube with X, Y, Z, W, and V axis. We see a 3D projection of this 5D object. Because that's how we can see it. Okay, new one. Let's create a new project of a person walking through a 3D space. It must add uh, buildings, time, cars, and people. Let's see it attempt this one. I remember in the olden days, um, 
a few years ago when they struggled to just set up a simple react application now look at them Okay, it's done. Let's see. Okay, here it is. Where am I? That human is sinking there. Someone must save that guy. This guy is going left, right. Oh, these cars are bumping like no one's business. And it's 4 a.m. here. They say we use WASD or the arrow keys to move the player. Scroll to zoom. Let's zoom out. This is not the best looking, although it's one prompt. What time is it? It's 9 a.m. Oh, it's misty today. Huh. It looks like we're this guy, but this guy is not moving. He's sinking. Okay, let's iterate once. Okay, let's iterate it. To make it make some changes. It says it's complete. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, the people are still wonky. They are still not looking too good. The arrow keys yeah, is not moving. Let's see which camera angle can I use here. Okay, it didn't do extremely well. That took a dollar and five cents. Out of curiosity, let's try the latest pro preview. This is the same price as Lord 4 Sonnet. Okay, okay, looks like it's ready. Let's run it. Okay, that failed. No, man. The rookies don't work. Nothing works here. This is worse. Okay, let's try Cloud 4 Opus. Let's try the best of the best here. As you can see, the costs are not friendly at all. They're already... Reaching 50 cents, just started. Okay, this is getting expensive. This better be a parallel universe. Eh? This was promising. This is the most expensive, but the best one.